you stop making excuses this is actually pretty simple and I said it the other day and you have to realize you have to know you have to accept that all your excuses are lies they are lies all of them think about the things that you tell yourself the lies you use to rationalize taking the easy road taking the easy road and leaving discipline behind think about them you don't have time that's a lie you don't have support that's a lie you don't have the equipment or the gear lies you don't you don't know the best way who cares that's a lie or you're too old or you're too young of course you're too old or too young lie and there's you're too busy sure you are that's a lie that's not an excuse
You need to put yourself on punishment. Recognize the excuses are not valid. They aren't. They're trumped up. They're conjured up. They're fabricated. They're lies. And how do you stop the lies? You stop the lies with the truth. The truth. The truth will set you free. The truth will stand and the truth will deliver you from procrastination and laziness and the downward spiral that comes with a lack of discipline. So don't believe the lies, believe the truth. And the truth is, you have time, you have the skill, you have the knowledge and the support and the willpower and the discipline to get it done. Cast out the lies, burn them down. You about to get a divorce, you just failed your bar exam, your team just lost in the championship. Like, don't try to be something you like, don't listen to stuff on and try to be something you're not. I said who I, who I was and where I'm from. I don't gotta act like I'm hard. I don't gotta act like I'm nothing, like I'm going to be who I am. Getting successful, whatever you consider successful, if it's rich, whatever, it's not a magic trick. You have a say-so in that. You can decide to be rich, and with God's help, it's highly doable. But you first have to think it. The difference between successful people and non-successful people is here. I'm no better than none of y'all. I'm not a better person than you. I'm not a better Christian than you. God don't love me more than you. None of that. What makes it hard is your lack of belief that it can happen for you. If you keep doing what you've been doing, you're gonna keep getting what you've been getting. You have to change some things. But you have to make a conscientious decision that you're going to change. And it's not dependent on anybody else. It don't matter what your mama think. It don't matter what your coworkers think. It don't matter what your siblings think. It don't matter what your children think. It don't matter. You missed the three years I was living in the car. You, you didn't see that. You missed when I lost everything I ever owned twice. You missed the two divorces. You missed me flunking out of school. You missed all that. You see this now. This ain't how it work now. Yeah, oh, it look easy. Yeah, I make it look easy. This is hard. Come out here. Go, come turn this corner and just do what I do. It's really hard. You need to tell you no.